Good evening, Dr. Suburb Theatre. Um, welcome to Queen for tonight, the fun quiz for women. <laughs> tonight we introduce another set of contestants for the title of Queen for tonight, the only show where only one queen can survive in each show. <laughs> contestants today are the wives of Henry VIII, and they are... Take a bow as I mention your name. Oh. Kathy, Annie, Jane, Anna, Katie, and Catherine. And tonight's prize will be a right royal night out with a celebrity. Oh, hello. But first, please welcome your quiz inquisitor, tougher than Anne Robinson. Oh, this is a fascist in England. <laughs> <laughs> Good evening. You will have a maximum of three questions <laughs> before, you, before you are either beheaded, divorced, or die in childbirth or otherwise. <laughs> Kathy, you are first. Your subject is Dublin. How would you describe the accents of the Irish people portrayed in The Night Alive? <laughs> um, um, I'm Spanish. So I don't really know about accents. Is she really English? Correct. Can you say how the female <laughs> character in the play was like Anne Boleyn? She was a whore! <laughs> <laughs> Who are you calling a whore? You clapped out those husbands. Now, ladies, correct answer. Can you describe the likely outcome of being hit over the head with a hammer several Dead. times? No. Two points, anyone? Yes. Um, a small head wound requiring only a bandage. <laughs> Katie, it's your turn. 
Your questions are about social policy. How would you describe the characters in the play? I, the lying kind. I think that man said they were challenged. <laughs> He so said everyone was challenged every night <laughs> so far. Well, that's his problem, but correct. <laughs> Casey, how many people in the play should have been in care, according to the evidence we saw? All of them. Correct. Now, what is the meaning of the term chav? Does it have something to do with the C word? What C word? Chihuahua? <laughs> no, two points. Catherine, your subject is Germany. Why are people from Hamburg like Americans? Ha! My first thought is overpaid, oversexed, and over here. <laughs> uh, give me a second. This has to do with Donald Trump, doesn't it? <laughs> yes, they chose a monster. <laughs> University. How would I know? Could it be the minor works of English literature? Oh, correct. The <laughs> <laughs> programme refers to, and I quote, prejudice, isolation, vengefulness, and the lack of responsibility that human beings feel for each other. How else would you express this? I've no idea. Two points, anyone? <laughs> prejudice! <laughs> correct. <laughs> One more point to everyone except Catherine. So all of you have lost your lives except Catherine. Oh, it's not fair! Oh, you cannot no. be serious! We simply like this hair. You're very dramatic. You got two points. Yeah, ladies, please. Yes, that's tough, but that's how it was being a queen under Henry. Catherine, you are tonight's survivor, and we'll go on to the final. But for now, we hope you enjoy tonight's prize of a right royal night out with a celebrity. Time to meet that celebrity. Who is here? In the audience. <laughs> <laughs>